Hi, morons! <laughs> hey, animation fans! Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into Memoir of a Snail, a beautifully crafted animated film that will make you look at life and time in a whole new way. If you're ready for an unforgettable journey with a small creature and big dreams, hit that like button, subscribe, and let's get into it. Let's start with the basics. Memoir of a Snail follows the story of Sila, a young snail who lives in a lush, vibrant forest. Unlike the other creatures who race around, Scylla dreams of something greater, the legendary Golden Leaf, which is said to grant eternal happiness and fulfillment. The only problem? Well, Silas a snail and moving fast just isn't an option. Silas' slow pace mirrors her deeper internal struggle. She feels left behind in a world where everything seems to be in a hurry. But despite this, she's determined. The golden leaf is her goal, and nothing will stop her. Along the way, Sila meets a cast of quirky characters, including an elderly tortoise who offers cryptic advice. The journey, not the speed, is what matters most. As Sila ventures further into the forest, things get tougher. She faces danger from predators like the sly crow and must navigate physical obstacles like a dried-up riverbed that threatens to halt her progress. But through every challenge, Silas' perception begins to shift. What makes this film so special is its quiet moments. As Sila moves slowly through the world, she starts noticing things others might miss. The way sunlight filters through the trees, the intricate patterns on the leaves, and the companionship of the animals she meets along the way. It's these moments of stillness that change her and us as viewers as we realize that the golden leaf might not be what she thinks it is. Eventually, after much struggle and growth, Sila reaches the spot where the golden leaf is said to be. But here's the twist. When she finds it, the leaf is old, crumpled, and decaying. The legend she's followed her entire life isn't the treasure she imagined. At first, Sila is devastated. The golden leaf, her ultimate goal, is nothing like what she expected. But in this moment, she has an epiphany. The journey itself was the real reward. The challenges, the friendships, and the growth she experienced were more valuable than the leaf ever could have been. So, what does this all mean? The Golden Leaf was never about achieving perfection or finding a physical prize. It represents our search for meaning and fulfillment, something that can't be rushed. Through Silas' slow journey, we learn that sometimes the most profound insights come when we stop racing through life and take the time to truly see the world around us. By the end of the film, Sila is no longer fixated on the Golden Leaf. She's found something even more valuable— peace with who she is and the journey she's been on. In the end, it's not about how fast we move, but about learning to appreciate each moment no matter how small. Memoir of a Snail is a beautiful meditation on time, patience, and the power of introspection. Its quiet, introspective tone is a breath of fresh air in a world where we're constantly rushing. The animation is stunning, with every scene feeling like a painting come to life. If you're a fan of deep, thoughtful storytelling, this is a must-watch. So, what did you think of Memoir of a Snail? Did Silas' journey resonate with you? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell so you never miss an animation deep dive like this one. Thanks for watching, and until next time, remember, slow down and enjoy the journey.